Web applications are critical systems in many networks. They store, process, and transmit data. They're also vulnerable to hackers. So the question becomes, how secure is your network? And how comprehensively has it been tested? To uncover these weaknesses before the hackers do, penetration testing is an essential tool. It will assess the security of the code and software being used by your applications, and it's one of the best practices you can undertake to keep your network safe from harm. Let's take a closer look. Preventable cyber attacks. Cyber attacks against web applications occur every day. Not all can be thwarted, but many could have been prevented had penetration testing been carried out. The Panama Papers breach made headlines in 2016, both for the data it revealed and its total disregard for securing web applications. The breach showed how certain individuals were able to offshore money in shell companies. The breach was made possible because of a vulnerable content management system plugin. If the plugin had been updated and secured, hackers wouldn't have been able to penetrate the application and breach the data. Vulnerability assessments versus penetration testing. Vulnerability assessments are carried out to determine a list of vulnerabilities and prioritize those for review. Those organizations employing a vulnerability assessment are often aware they have security issues and need help identifying them. Penetration tests, however, are more comprehensive and intrusive than a vulnerability assessment and are designed to enact a specific hacking scenario. They're often used by companies that are confident in their security posture. Penetration testing analyzes true risk. As an example, a vulnerability assessment will give you a list of independent vulnerable systems. However, a penetration test will inform you of the risk from an attack that could compromise a critical asset. Automated versus manual. Certain parts of a penetration test can be automated, but manual analysis and testing is critical. Automated testing tools offer many advantages like speed and wider coverage. However, not all penetration testing can be completed with automated tools. It takes a highly skilled analyst to perform manual testing. A manual approach tests for business logic vulnerabilities, which automated tools don't understand. Automated tools won't always have the most up-to-date knowledge when new vulnerabilities are released. They also have a high false positive rate, and manual testing is often used to validate these. For the most effective penetration testing, there should be a combination of automated and manual testing. Third-party testing. While many organizations may complete internal penetration testing, it's not as effective as third-party. When your own team looks at their own code and applications, it's not a fresh set of eyes. It's like proofreading your own article. Your developers are typically experts in their domain and application, but they're not cybersecurity experts, which is why you need specially trained professionals to carry out the testing. Risk Management Program. There are many tools used in cybersecurity. Robust programs try to address every possible situation. Penetration testing is one of the tools in your arsenal. It can help determine weaknesses within your infrastructure, applications, and people. Plus, it can spot mistakes made by coders, ensure controls are effectively implemented, and discover new bugs within your software. Your data is something you don't want to have at risk. Alpine Security is here to help design a customized testing solution to keep your network safeguarded. Visit our site today to learn more about protecting your business from a cyber attack. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.